Let me ask you, does this look like a comfortable chair? Well, it's not, my friends. If you're looking for a comfortable moto camping chair that you can also sleep in, stick around and I'm gonna tell you what I use. <laughs> It slices, it dices, it's a moto camping chair and a sleeping apparatus. You can sleep in this camping chair. Aloha from the big island of Hawaii. I'm hanging, literally hanging, uh, at one of my favorite camping spots, just a couple miles from the house, actually, uh, hanging off the cliffs of Kao, which is uh, just a few miles outside of the eastern town of Hilo on the big island and I was inspired after reading uh, it's a thread that I posted almost two years ago on a site called ADV Rider um, you may be watching this as a result of reading that thread or watching some of my videos my guess is that you've probably watched a few of most of you have watched a few of my videos before you would know that i'm really into moto camping motorcycle camping um, and specifically hammock camping that's one of the things that i do it's one of the things that i enjoy most on planet earth um, it allows me to go very far away on a motorcycle and hammock camping specifically allows me to a lot more opportunity to camp in places i could not camp um, without a hammock uh, this is not a good example of that type of camping because there's lots of nice flat uh, relatively even soft ground here you could probably pitch 15 20 tents in here easily and if you couldn't pitch them right around here you can go into the woods what I'm talking about are the places that are uh, like I would say most of this island would be uh, covered in lava. There's not a lot of soil here on most of the island. So uh, if you can find a couple of trees, you can hang in between two trees comfortably and not have to look for a great spot like this that will take either hammocks or tents. So that's why I have come to love hammock camping. But specifically, I, I was inspired by this thread that I made a couple of years ago, shortly after I made the video. The five reasons you should hammock camp on a motorcycle and i came up with five reasons and they're all pretty good reasons and two of the reasons at the end were bonus reasons and one of the bonus reasons so actually there was there were seven reasons but uh, i started out with five and then I, as i was making the video i came up with a couple more anyway um one of the bonus reasons was that you can use your hammock as a chair like i'm doing now and i love the fact that i can do this i love the fact that not only um i don't have to sit down in a rickety chair that may not hold my 300 pound ass um, but it's much more comfortable and you can swing unlike a chair um, so i think i think this is the one of the things i didn't really go into a lot of detail on but it's one of those things that inspired me today and i started thinking man you know i love hanging out here on the cliffs and i do this so often that it's just kind of the second nature either i take a chair or i take a hammock or i take like today I, I brought both but i wanted to show you how similar it was how easy it was especially with my hammock and my setup uh, despite my <laughs> lack of of grace and fluidity i could still set one of these hammocks up in record time um, i believe i did a, a a video recently well within the last couple of years on a a relatively cheap uh i'm trying to remember what they call these chairs he helinox i didn't buy, buy the helinox because i didn't want to pay 80 dollars for a chair but i think i spun like 30 but 30 bucks on this chair anyway um, it's much more similar to a setup to a hammock time-wise, at least for my hammock. It would take me, I would say, two minutes to take that thing out of the bag, put the sticks together, and feed the sticks into the, into the legs. Probably take me close to two minutes, which is about the same. What it would take me two minutes. I always say less than five minutes, but less than five minutes to set this hammock up is getting the straps all perfectly adjusted so I can sleep in it like this. This is a little bit loose, actually, but um, it's hung well, and I can sleep in this. But more specifically, I can, 
I can hang out here and uh, just chill and drink a couple beers and watch the sun uh, go down uh, in a beautiful environment. And it's just as easy, almost as easy as most of uh, your folding chairs at least. Um, but anyway, I just wanted to make a follow-up video and talk about hammocks as a chair. And you can use the cheapest hammock as a chair. Um, I would not recommend uh, using cheap hammocks to sleep or camp in. Um, well, it depends on whether you can sleep on your back or not. I don't find it very comfortable at all. Um, so the more, the more you spend on a hammock, typically the better you sleep. But when it comes to being a chair, I think uh, you know a twenty-five, thirty-dollar hammock would probably do just fine to do something like this. And especially if you get something that you could rig up really quick and easily around some trees. I'm not so sure how much camping I would do if I wasn't comfortable. So I rely on my Warbonic hammock to do so much of my camping, I, I really don't know what I would do without it. And that's all I've got to say about that.